Hello, friends, and welcome to this week's live stream. Tyler was making some little noises. That some noise. little noises. Yeah. I'm not sure if he stopped before we started rolling. I did but actually stop, I okay, think. Because yeah. you were like not sure about it. I wasn't sure if I should do that. Yeah. It would be weird. Yeah. It's okay, we did it anyway. No. Yeah, exactly. Um, all right, well, hello, everyone. I feel like we, we've been gone for a second. I know. We weren't streaming last week, but we're back. This is the comeback tour. This is the comeback tour. Yeah. The Suck It Joan comeback tour. The suck It Joan comeback tour. Come um, at you. I actually just like the shirt. It's cute. Yeah. You look cute now. Yeah. You, you look very put together. Tyler is very put together today. Yes. Haircut, shaved, suck at Joan. I'm the one who's a mess. It's a trifecta. tousled mess. A, the trifecta. Yeah. The hair, the face, the suck at Joan. The yes, trifecta. Exactly. Um, anyway, happy Tuesday, guys. I hope everyone's having a good Tuesday. Had an okay weekend, decent Monday, and possibly a Wednesday. Yes. Depending on where you are. Exactly. Um, we are not going to address the title and thumbnail for one more hot second. We're going to do our updates overall, okay. and then we'll dive into the thumbnail and title of this video. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because I saw some people being concerned in the chat. They should be. They should be. About the thumbnail you and the title, be. yes. You should be. Very reasonable reaction. Yes. Yeah. So, updates. Also say hi to Mod oh. Holly and new Mod Alexia. Ooh, yeah. Holly was mo a mod last time. Alexia is the new mod. So we have two mods. Yeah, watch out, or they'll yeah. ban you. Exactly. <laughs> 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 Van Hammer. Yes. Okay, so updates. Do you want to go through them? Do you want me to start? You can start. Why don't you start. model? Yes. While I drone on. Suck it, Joan. Okay, so Here's Tyler's t shirt, shirt this week yeah. is Suck it, Joan. Which, if which you guys. Yeah, you want? Is from our Age of Empire stream, yeah. basically. It's a, it's an inside joke, but it's also available to for anyone to know. Yes. If you go and watch that. <laughs> Not stream. available for purchase. Yeah. It was a fake merch item. Yes. Fake merch. There is three renditions of the Suck it, Joan. This is mine with the word bubble. I think Carly's has the best one. It's got a chicken on it. I don't know why. The At some point, yes. we will reveal Carly's shirt. Yes. <laughs> um, it's funny because we're like working on real merch, but we just keep advertising fake merch. I was just actually going to wear the real merch. merch sample today. Oh. But it's th that one's only a hoodie. Right, so right, I thought right, I'd right. get it. Like, you know, I already have right. the sweating complex. And then we have these buzzing machines that are theoretically emitting heat. I'm looking in. There's like an orange light. Universal <laughs> sign for heat. So... <laughs> <laughs> I thought I was supposed to do the droning sound bites. Droning, go. All right, Ty, here's your model the mug of the day. I I put the coffee in this mug. It's a Grinch mug. Yes. Um, because it's November Maddie. 2nd, November 1st, November 2nd. Yes. November 2nd, which means it's Christmas. Yes. Guys. Oh, okay. well, actually, go, go back to it. Inside the rim, there's it, also them singing. Sorry, there is some it's foam. It's pretty gross. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> They're just drowning. Yeah. Drowning in foam. Yes. Um, it's Christmas, guys. It's November 2nd. It's Christmas. According to my TikTok, that is the official day that we're allowed to do this. Yep. There's been many jokes bemoaning the fast start to Christmas decorations, as well as people being excited about it. You know? I'm fine with it. I'm fine with it. Yes. In, in my mind, the parts of the year are the first part, then there's my birthday, then there's Halloween, and then there's Christmas. My very old school <laughs> like <it>. metric <laughs> system was that uh, it was after Thanksgiving is when you could start doing like sort of uh, Christmas celebrating. But that's been wiped clean, and now we're starting on November 1st, I think is the new official date. Yeah. I mean, the advertising is going to just start to descend. Every YouTube ad is going to be about it now. It's going to start. Yeah. Yeah, exactly. I saw a midnight on November 1st. I saw a TikTok of Mariah Carey smashing a pumpkin in. I was like, okay. Yeah. Was it was it's Mariah it season. primary Mariah content? Yeah. Oh, they didn't like superimpose Mariah's face no. over like Michael Myers. No. Yeah. She's leaning in. I've seen a lot of me Mariah content. Yeah, me yeah. Mariah. I feel like there's also this like <laughs> light flashing onto Sophia's face. So at times Sophia will have Oompa Loompa vibes. With I also orange have Oompa Loompa yeah. vibe a because of the way that my like lightened ends are reading on camera, and also because I am a hard boiled egg. I just I'm freshly showered and skin cared, so right. I just look like a shiny egg. Right. Eggish. Eggish qualities. <laughs> what? <laughs> you, you said, You're supposed to tell me I look cute. You You're look not cute. supposed to say, yes, you do look what cute. What if I like <laughs> eggs? I like <laughs> eggs. Right? Uh, I like eggs. I'm in the show. Okay, so what other, the other... The only other updates yes. that we have are, A, that we are working on actually a couple main channel videos. We're scrubbing along. Yes. Scrolling along right, on a couple right, right. main channel videos. Yes. One that Maddie is working on. We were editing earlier today, so we're all a little brain dead, but yeah. it's cool because we're going to eat some weird cotton candies, but we'll get to that in a second. Um, and uh, another, which is a Franken video, which we are going to probably do a giveaway for. Yes. So gird your loins. Right. Um, okay, I was also going to give a quick crusty update. Oh, yeah. Okay, so just in case 
for whatever reason, during this video or the stream, Sophia and I seem distracted or a little off. Uh, the honest answer is that Krusty is not doing that well right now. Um, That's true. He is at the hospital, um, but he's being treated. And I just got off the phone with the technician, and like some of the indicators are more positive, but there could still be underlying things. It's just like 21 year old cat dynamics, but it's been a pretty long couple days. Um, but we think that he could turn a corner, so fingers crossed. But if he, you know, things don't go as well as we hope, um, obviously it's on our mind, but um, I don't want anyone to, you know, worry about Krusty because I don't think Krusty would want people to worry about him. He's just chugging along, he's eating, he's having fun, he's trying to, you know, stay with us. So, yeah. Yeah, so that's, that's the update there. Um, we're doing everything we can. So, I know that's kind of a somber note, but I just don't want I just don't want you guys to be like, what's something wrong in the back of your mind? Like the answer is like, yeah, there's a little bit of something wrong, but we're trying to, you know, we want to do a stream, we want to have some fun, and then you know, I just there's nothing else we can do. I just got off the phone with the technician, so yeah, cool. You okay? No, I'm fine. All right, cotton candy. I'm compartmentalizing. Yes. And also, yeah, I did cut my hair too, and I lightened my ends, and they're looking lighter here than yeah. they were previously, and I'm not sure how I feel about it, but we're just gonna keep going. Yes. I, I traded one broom vibe for a different broom vibe. <laughs> right. <laughs> but you did, you did cut your hair, actually, since last stream. And then the actual other update is Carly also came with us to Colonial Williamsburg last week, yeah. which was, oh, yeah. you know, we'll see how that goes. It was a really fun filming <laughs> session. It was very tiring, so I can't really, like, parse through Dude, my the exhaustion. Co the and cobblestones my, will kill you. My tired legs, my crouching, my, like, sore back. But I think that we came out with something good, so, yeah. yeah. Okay. So uh, now should we explain what we're doing today? Yes. Now that we've gone through all of the things. Yes. <laughs> all of the That's things. That's a big update round, yes. Um, okay, so today, in case you couldn't tell by the thumbnail or title of this stream, we are going to be making bizarre custom cotton candies. Um, basically, <laughs> Carly found this, it's all from one website, right Carly? Yeah. Carly found this one website that sells really weird candy. And we also <laughs> found a cotton candy machine that makes cotton candy out of any hard candy that right. you have. So, so this is an intersection one. These are exactly. multiple things coming together. Exactly. Look look at this machine that is meant for nice, normal cotton candies. Nope, we're not going to be putting good stuff in there. No. We're going to be putting only awful things in yes. there. Um, we have not, I have not tried any of these. Tyler's not tried any of these. Carly has tested one or two just to make sure they work in the machine. Um, per the thumbnail, a few weeks ago, she did make a a cone of lobster cotton candy. Um, Which is right there. That it, candy is there. It did stink. It did stink up. Oh, the yeah. Office. No. It, I mean, it almost got <laughs> Allie to the point where she was requesting that we don't have her be the second yeah. cam on this so, stream because it just it emanates Maddie like Maddie has but fallen on the Maddie proverbial is, is sword. Up, up on deck. But it's actually, this is organic because we were going to do it with, with Allie originally and then like things moved around. Um, so, but yes. Maddie got screwed over by Colonial Williamsburg. That's what yeah, happened. Exactly. <laughs> now um, she's here at That is stream. the original timing and dates. Yeah. But um, this thing, uh, I don't know what, what happened, but I walked into our apartment that day and it was just like a tidal wave of noxious really gas. <laughs> I mean, we'll get to it. Yeah. It does, yeah, Maddie's nodding. Yes. We'll get to it. It didn't really smell like lobster, but it smelled like something. Yeah. Um, <laughs> Sensory things or, or nose. Nasal sensory dynamics are like the number one hazard in this workplace. <laughs> Going back to our Bath and Body Works yeah. one where it would clear out the entire office and we have more candle content potentially. And there was some soap related content that was the only thing that was able to battle back the lobster candy <laughs> after multiple days of it living within our apartment complex. But there's so, a good bet that that'll happen again. So we can air it this out This room <laughs> does have a window. So that's our best that's bet. True. Yeah, that is our best bet. Um, um, wasn't there yet? Yeah, well, yeah, I was just going to say point. that some before the stream started, some people were very concerned because of the thumbnail yeah. that we were like about to boil a live lobster <laughs> no. and like turn it into cotton candy, and they're like, they wouldn't do that, right? No, no, no. <laughs> this <laughs> that is, would be so intense. This is very, very artific artificial. Everything in terms of these flavors, I believe. So um, there will be no live lobster dynamics here. So yes, um, is the mechanics of this? Uh, you have reviews of this machine, Saf, right? That we can use yes. as a sort of an indicator of how this day is going to go. Here are some Amazon reviews. Exactly. I have one that is from Gladiator. Right. One star. Dirt in the cone? Well, it literally just arrived, and there is nothing wrong with the machine that I know of yet, but there is dirt in one of the cones, and I'm sure that means that this was previously used, which is upsetting. Or y'all just put dirt in your cones? Thanks, WTF. Right. So maybe this was found in an Amazon return store. 
right? Or it was at a liquidation Treasure center. hunt liquidators. Sent right back, yeah. <laughs> um, from Veronica, five out of five stars. Oh, exceeding wow. Exceeding expectations. I can see why this is a bit of a fire hazard and not a good activity to do with small children because you're playing <laughs> with a hot spinning plate full of melted candy. But this machine is the best and makes great cotton candy. It's really fun and easy to use. Lifelong dream come true. That's some big rhetoric right there. Yeah. They acknowledge the hazard for children, yet still threw the five stars up. Absolutely. That's a good sign. After the dirt. Nikita says five out of five stars. Needs at least 15 minutes to heat up before using. Takes forever just to get a little cotton candy. Well, still liked it enough to give it five out of five stars. Update. Oh. Oh. The, oh. It was revised to add more stars <laughs> later. Update, not so bad after all. It takes about 15 minutes to heat up for use, but that's when it works best. For in-house, for in, for in-house, for in-house use, wow. For, for in-house. <laughs> for in-house use. I wouldn't recommend for a party. It would take too long if there are more than five people requesting it. Right. Cool. Well, there's just you and me, Ty. I don't think anyone else is going to be requesting it. That's why so. this one's running right now. So we're oh, yeah, preheating we, we did kind it. of not mention why that was happening. Do we this one up, too? Or are we going to... We can do it later. It takes about 15 minutes, but yeah. once you start doing that one, we'll preheat that one. We'll hit that guy. Okay, cool. that one can, get, can do, too. Are we running these guys out to the wall? Yeah, well, out there, yeah. Something <laughs> about this <laughs> just feels pasta maker-esque. We have yeah. two machines. Yeah, but we're good. Okay, so the mechanics, I forget. Um, we have... I have an egg. I just keep looking at myself. I'm an egg. <laughs> okay, so um, we're gonna. We, we Laura have G says, "Why is there cup? Why is there cup? Why is there ketchup in the thumbnail? It's because there's ketchup candy." Yes. Because it's a possibility. What were you saying? I what are, so we we could because we really well we've deduced with all our fancy math is that we really have like four shakes at this between the two machines right. over the course of this stream. Until um, the, the buildup becomes too much and we can no longer use the machine. We'd have to clean it, which would take too long. So we are not doing that live. So we have. Basically, at most, four takes on this thing. Yes. So we were going to ask the chat of the available options what they were most interested in seeing us consume. Right. So I don't know, Maddie, if you want to give them like a, here's, here are all the options. Take a gander. Yes. And just, I'll watch the chat like a hawk. We have fried chicken, pickle candy, pizza candy, ketchup candy, kale candy, yikes, lobster candy, faux candy, pho candy. Pho. Take whatever pronunciation said, you want. You said faux. <laughs> Not F-A-U-X. No, faux pho candy, mac and cheese candy. I mean, listen, you got a lot of winners in there. I really hope the pho candy's made because I want to try that. I'm actually interested in the pho candy as well. Yeah, I'm a, yeah, I'm a big fan. Mac and cheese and pho sound yes. interesting to me. Those, I think that mac and cheese is okay. also one that Allie was very concerned about <laughs> because Allie found a mac and cheese candle at a thrift store recently. It and is she's at TJ Maxx. Not even a thrift it's store. TJ place. <laughs> trying okay. to get a good deal on that candle, yes. I'm seeing a lot of pickle, a lot of pho. Pickle and pho, lobster, maybe mac and cheese. This is actually a very good mechanism for disqualification. Because I see almost no, well, I saw the kale right there. No, I, the kale is low on the list. Kale's low on the list. Yeah, I'm seeing mac and cheese, pho, pickle, lobster. Okay. Right? That's Which, kind of what I'm seeing. Well, here's the, here's, here's a rule. I'm setting exactly a rule, hard rule here. Although lobster. Some people wanted chicken, but lobster has to be last. No matter what we do, <laughs> we're not doing lobster early. We're gonna right. do it. We're gonna leave this room, re-enter with hazmat suits on, and then we'll just like I don't know, fire extinguish the whole place, and just hope that it, that gets rid of some essence of lobster. Oh, people are saying I can do a poll. Oh my god, can I? Oh, uh, oh, I can do a poll. I'm gonna do a live poll. Oh but wow. How many options can I do? I mean, a lot. Let's see. Okay. Here we go. No, I can only have four options. Okay, four options. So, so why don't we, uh, why don't we start with um, mac and cheese? Like we eliminate lobster. Like I said, lobster can't be on deck for the first one. Okay. For the first one. Right. No. Yeah. Mac for and cheese. For the first one, I'm going to do a poll. I'm going to put it in the chat right now. For the first cotton candy, we're saying mac and cheese. Pho. Pickle. Pickle. Pho. Pho. And maybe chicken. Let's do chicken. That's a good round. Ask your community. Boom. Hit that. Okay. Did it work? I don't know where it is. <laughs> Oh, there it there is. There it is. Okay, cool. All right, okay. how long does it last? I don't, I think I ha can end it, but okay. I don't see there's, anyone voting on it. It currently yet. says zero votes. Is it working? I don't know. Is it working? Chat, tell us. Is it working? Oh, 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 this is happening okay. live. Oh my God, this is so crazy. Yeah. I've never used this tool before. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Very interactive. It seems like mac and cheese and pickle are winning. Okay, why don't we close the polling at s when it says 516 on our clock? Five, six, okay, so right. one more minute. That could be 216. That could be... How do I see it? This is hard. 1 a.m. 16? Should I re just refresh to see? Oh, no. Oh, oh, the votes are coming in. Yes. Oh, oh, okay. Oh, this is a three-way tie between mac and cheese, pickle, and pho. Chicken is... 
<laughs> Maddie, Maddie is going to vote too. Vote. <laughs> <laughs> All right, well, I just hit 16. Maddie, have you voted yet? No. Okay, Maddie's going. <laughs> Once Maddie has Once voted, Maddie locks in that's the vote. when it has the last vote, yes. Lock in your answer. Okay. What do you guys think? Okay. I feel like mac and cheese is winning. One minute ago. Are you? All right. Mac and cheese. Okay. Mac and cheese. Okay, let's let's close it. All right, let me close. Like, 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 end poll. End poll. Oh. Okay. Where did it go? Ne nowhere. There oh yeah, there it is. There it is. All right. So mac and cheese with thirty-three percent of the vote. We had twenty-five hundred votes in like a minute. Pretty That's fast. Pretty That's pretty good. Mac and cheese, pickle and fall were close though. Chicken would be out. Yeah, okay. Sorry, yeah, yeah, chicken's really lagging behind here. So, mac and cheese is first, baby. Where is it? Oh, bottom, right the bottom, bottom. Yeah. It's kind of confusing because I would have said the mac and cheese would be orange, but it's red and yellow. Okay, cool. What, what, what? So these candies are candies, though. Right, let's let's. So they we, should we try the candies or should we treat everything as everything cotton? fresh? Everything fresh is cotton candy. Okay, here's cool. the the mac and cheese. I'm gonna candy. turn this guy off, right? To place it. Yeah, you have to take the wrapping off too. Yes, <laughs> the wrapping will not be Imagine cotton if we didn't. candized. Yeah. Look at these little hands. Yeah, they are cool. Are these official cotton candy hard you candy need, uh, placing? You need two candies. Oh, you took two out. Okay. Did you not take a second one out? No, I did not. Yeah. <laughs> How dare you? How dare you? What do they smell like? I'm that smells kind of bad. I'm doing everything fresh. <laughs> <laughs> All right, cool. All right, do we have do we have a, a view of? I think our I just have Krusty on the brain because this smells like him. Oh, side note, can you start preheating the second one? Oh, oh no! <laughs> yes, I can. <laughs> what happened there? Uh, <laughs> uh, do you know this kind of smells like what? Maybe it does actually smell like the cheese packet inside, like the dry cheese packet inside a mac and cheese pasta thing. I got nothing. I can't smell anything right now. Well, no, but I can't smell that thing specifically. Uh -oh. I can smell <laughs> other things right now. <laughs> oh, it smells like um, one of those like Jelly Belly things. When like Jelly Belly goes for like one those, of the weird ones. Yeah, like buttered like the, popcorn. It doesn't. It doesn't not smell like the buttered popcorn Jelly Belly. Right. But at the same time, it smells like sharper than right. that. It yeah. has a bit of an edge to it. All right, let's place it. Okay, ready? No. Yes. All right. Here we go. All right. On either side, right, Carly? Yeah. It's like one over here. Oh, it's making How noise. That, is that good? I can't well, really see. Carly actually can't see it, so it's, we're going to. It's in it, right? Yes, it is. Okay. All right, I'm going to turn it on, Carly. Okay. Ready? Let there be cotton candy. Okay, here we go. All right. So that guy is spritzing. It's going. Ooh, I already see it flying into oh, the air. Oh, 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 it's lifting. It's going to be hard to see. It's lifting. Oh, 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 okay, so do I start going? Yeah. Oh, I okay. do twist too, right? Yeah. That was immediate. Oh, this stuff is never leaving the room. No wonder it smelled for weeks, because it just lifts into the atmosphere. It literally took our Franken video to get the smell out. <laughs> slightly yellow. It is definitely a little yellow. You can start to see like a ring around the side. Okay. Oh you can like smell cheese. it already. It does smell like cheese, doesn't it? It smells like cheese. It smells like cheese. <laughs> I'm ready for cheese. Oh man, and it's very an inconsistent I'm wafting because it hits cheese. you in different ways. Yeah. All right, I'm switching. Carly recommended that at some point I switch to this method. Oh yeah, it smells like cheese. Artificial cheese though, not even human cheese. Like cheese, cheese product. <laughs> yeah, cheese related. Oh man, it smells like kid cheese product Dude, too. Dude, this is gonna be big. Yeah. <laughs> this is gonna be massive. <laughs> Dude, what's her name was right? Carolina, no, Veronica. Veronica, the child hating Amazon reviewer. She was right, this is great. <laughs> this is awesome. Look at this. Do you think that uh, we should uh, introduce this to the people, the good people at the Imshul Cheese theme park? Oh yeah. <laughs> Excuse me. <laughs> <laughs> so you guys like goats? How about cheese cotton candy? <laughs> Mac and cheese cotton candy. Yeah. I you know. I'm trying to put my finger on it because I think that the Jelly Belly is a cop out for what it smells like. What are oh. other kid cheese things like? Does that seem that seems like most of it? What do you think, Carly? Yeah, it, yeah. It seems like it's probably about done. Should I keep that guy rolling or should I turn it off? Turn it off for now. Okay. Yeah. Okay. There we go. So, that is one hard candy tested, the mac and cheese. It smells... Actually... It smells like those popcorn seasonings. That yes! You can dump Garrett's on. popcorn. Yeah. Mm. It is like a really cheesy popcorn. It's very cheesy. 
It's interesting because when you come really close to it, it also kind of smells like a melted crayon. Oh, okay. No. Oh, yeah. Close to it. Melted crayon is spot on. I don't know what that Radiator is. Radiator crayon. Maybe it's just like the smell of like the, the heat. <laughs> the heat. There is something. It is tapping <laughs> into my brain. It's almost like creepy crawler era. Like long time ago, some kind of product. Mm. Courtney Hartley just said pinky in the brain. I think maybe she's referring to us, and I agree. <laughs> I agree. Um, CR says cheese whiz. It does. I, I I've never had cheese whiz. Cheese actually. whiz has more of a legitimate cheese scent to it. This is it, much. It's sort of like the essence of cheese whiz. Um, this has almost got like I would say like if Lunchables had like a like a mac and cheese thing, it has like a twinge of like cafeteria, like almost like summer camp cafeteria mac and cheese. Um, Prati Rupa Sarkar says, why is the other machine on so it can heat up? Otherwise, you guys would be waiting forever for it's it to just heat up later. for not, then. Yes. 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 Oh, I stopped yes. going to jump in here. Yes. Lunchable cheese, I saw that. Lunchable cheese is not, that. that is a little bit over the target. Lunchable cheese. Oh, All right, ready? This? Yes. This okay. is it. This is our beautiful creation. Did you already show Maddie? No, I did not. It's a beautiful creation. It does look like a giant Q-tip. Someone no. said, I think uh, I think the chat name was Grandmaster Yoda or something. Oh. They said it looks like a giant Q-tip, and I agree. It does look like a giant Q-tip. Yeah. My only complaint with it so far is I'm not smelling enough of the pasta undertones. Yeah, it's all cheese. Yeah. It's all cheese. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> all right, let me get a little piece, too. We can do a little cheers. Moment. Are you ready? Yep. All right, cheers. Say this. Oh, my God. Oh. Dude, it's awful. good. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's gnarly. I saved a chat for this specific moment before the stream even started, and Ebony said, I can't wait for Sophia to say she likes it. She has a, such an accepting palate. <laughs> an accepting palate. Maybe that's true. I used to be a really picky eater as a kid, but maybe it, oh everything's changed. Oh, my God. Give me some of that. Okay, here's my thought. It smells in the room really like powdery cheese product, it's like so sharp. Sweet. But it really just tastes like one of those butter popcorn jelly beans. It's so sweet. Like it is, it's sweet, right? It's sweet but cheesy. Cheesy but sweet. Not dangerously cheesy. I mean, dangerous to my taste buds, but it's like sweet but cheesy. It's really not that bad. Oh my god. What do you not like about it? I don't know. Are you are you are you out of your mind? <laughs> Am I out of my mind? Here's my other thought, is that of all the other, oh my god, it just fell down the stick. <laughs> of all the options that we have out here today, there's no way that mac and cheese is going to be the worst. So no. if you already don't like this, right. you are in for a wild ride. I gotta psych myself in. It's like when you are, myself in. you sort of train yourself to like Brussels like sprouts over years. <laughs> Even though Brussels like sprouts sugar. are solid and they're mostly bacon at this point in the world, mm. but like you kind of trick here, yourself into liking some of these things. I'm going to no, trick myself a little into like into my coffee. What are you doing there? I'm just... <laughs> It's okay. You going for a cotton candy latte? Yeah. <laughs> it sounds like... I mean, it's like buttery and dairy-y. That sounds like something that, um, like, Refinery29 could write about. Like, cotton candy lattes. Um, it's really good. <laughs> so <laughs> It's super dairy-ish. Yes. You guys can all go, okay? It's really good. Carly, did you try this one? No, I did not. Okay, so... I this tried is just the lobster one first, and then I didn't want to try any of the other ones. <laughs> would, you, would you like to try this, Maddie? All right. As a third opinion here. <laughs> Maddie does not like it. <laughs> okay, so I'm Maddie, the problem. Maddie though. does not like it, yeah. Am I the drama? Is it me? You are the drama, yeah. <laughs> it's all you. Um, as People the chat said, accepting, very accepting. <laughs> Maddie People doesn't like it. <laughs> want us to compare it to the candy, but at the same time, you guys, I mean, so finally, after like weeks, our pumpkin spice stream went back up. You guys see what happens to us after too many sweets. Yeah. I want to make it to the end. Yes. So I don't want to just consume a whole candy. I want to make it to the end with full mental capacity, right? Because <laughs> we, we did get to the end, but it was uh, it was questionable. Um, also, oh, Adler you says, soft, are you okay, LOL? I don't know. <laughs> I just, I can't stop looking at myself in the monitor and just being like, I'm just a broom. That's who I am. Broom though. or egg? Which one are you? I'm both. Okay. I'm a, an egg topped by a broom. You know what I'm, it is? Okay. It's like those, the, that TikTok trend from like two years ago where they did makeup on potatoes and oh, then yeah. put them in like a nest of hair. That's what I am. Oh, kind of, actually. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> kind of, I see that. Yeah. yeah. Now, that was a potato, but I do see some of the similarities. <laughs> yeah, okay. Uh, uh, someone, oh, this was funny. 
Nikki Goodbread says maybe Sav has jacked up her taste buds after all the not food she tries. Yeah, maybe after eating a lot of like candles and lipsticks, I'm like, this? Good. <laughs> Very good. <laughs> Actually meant for human consumption? Exactly. Yeah, he meets that threshold. Okay. I would turn the machine on like, just for a bit. Uh, get this guy going. Okay, let's do another poll. Yes. Right? Let's uh -huh. figure out what should be next. Okay, mac and cheese. <laughs> Lauren Burke says, soft the breg. <laughs> Broom egg. No. Oh. All right, here comes the poll. What were our options? So pickle, pho, and something else. What was it? Pickle, pho. Chicken's out. Sorry, guys. Chicken's out. Chicken's gone. Pickle, pho. What else should be in there? And we're just kind of just doing lobster last. Right? Lobster's happening last. Lobster. This is our second uh, audience choice. Let's, this is not a bad do trio here. Okay, we'll do... Fo, fa, fa, fo, fo, fa. Sorry, I. Fi, fi, fa. It's funny because I never call it fo. I always call it fa. And now it's just in my head. All right, so fa, pickle, ketchup, fa, and ketchup. Pickle. I'll ask. Yeah, exactly. I'm not asking about lobster because we're just doing lobster. Lobster's happening. Lobster's just a given. Wait, wait, pizza's in there, right? Pizza. pizza. Yeah. Oh, I'll add, I'll add yeah. pizza. Fourth option, pizza. I don't want pizza to fall off here. Great. All right, pull is in. <laughs> exactly. Okay, hold on. Sorry, and I'm fixing in my case bra. You guys <laughs> are wondering about a Franken dynamic here. I am going to keep co <laughs> our cones <laughs> nice. on the side here, <laughs> on the table, on our table, and we'll do a, like a Franken bite at the end. Franken bite. Yeah, yeah Franken I think that bite. we actually, obviously, we we knew that you guys were going to ask about it. Talk to Carly about the. <laughs> here we go. Let's take a look here. Um, someone just asked. Katie Church says, did you ever fall and get a concussion that could lead to liking odd flavors? <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. I don't think so. That's very like, what is that? That is it's not dying Why another. are you the way that you are? <laughs> the world is not enough or whatever from like a James Bond where the guy has like a like a, like a stray bullet from James Bond lodged in his head so he can't like feel pain. Oh yeah. At yeah, all. Yeah. yeah. So like, yeah, one of those things. One of those things, right. Yeah, yeah that's what happened to me. <laughs> yeah. Um, no, but we actually discussed a Franken dynamic and I think we decided based on the fact that like these machines can get kind of clogged that doing a Franken bite with like multiple yes. of the cotton candies together at the end is the best call. Exactly. Not like crafting a Franken cone. Right. If that makes sense. Right. Okay. Our poll has been up for almost a minute. Let's see. Let's see. Oh. Ooh. Pickle. Pickle is running with it. Pickle is running with it. I'm going to end the poll actually because it's been, we already have 2,500 votes. I feel like that there is a capacity now with the chat now that they saw that the, the, uh, mac and cheese one. The mac and cheese one has a pretty strong effect. Then maybe is it go for the potentially good tasting one or go for the crazy one, right? That's the that's the dynamic. Yeah. Pickle doesn't sound like a particularly good cotton candy. Pizza sounds fun. See, so maybe fried chicken sounded good. Here's the thing is that pickle and pho are just really front runners because pickle has 34%, pho had 27%. Then pizza at 24, pizza's not bad, but at the same time pizza's like kind of Kind of good. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, not that the other foods are not good, but just when you think of them with cotton candy, it seems worse. And ketchup's last. Oh, that's a good so point. Mac out. and cheese is also like very standard, and I like pho more than all of these things. So I was Great. Like, please choose pho for the last one. That's all I'm asking. I want to try the pho candy in general. Yeah. Great. All right, pick uh, pickle. Yes. Pickle. 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 Here, show show Maddie the pickles. Great. Show me the pickles. I can't see the screen. So, uh, I don't know what happened. Oh, press info. No, yeah. Okay. Here we go. Is it dying? No. I haven't had pho in a hot second. <laughs> but it's getting colder, so it's like a perfect time now, I feel like, for pho. I'm just sitting here holding this go. up. <laughs> yeah. People are asking for lipstick cotton candy. I think that we mentioned in... Oh, there, there we go. Beautiful! <laughs> <laughs> Why are you looking away? <laughs> I was Don't look at me. Okay. Don't look at me. Um, yeah, pickle, li pickle, lipstick, cotton candy wouldn't work because it needs like candy. So right. even though we do still have edible lipsticks, I don't think they're candy enough. What do you think? We're ready Not to Not enough sugar here? content. Yeah. Do you have two? I I have one. This is like one of those things where, sort of, uh, gives me, as you said, bean boozled vibes. Yes. Where like white with green stripes could be anything. It could right. be mint. It could be pistachio. It could be. Why say it like that? I don't know. <laughs> it could pistachio. be. Pistachio. It's because of my like, long running concussion. <laughs> it could be, you know, it hmm. could be uh, uh, green apple. No, it's pickle. It looks like a green apple. I gotta be, right. I gotta be real. Yeah. All right, turn it off. Turn it off. All right. And let's place it down here. Okay. There we go. Coming in. It is kind of still wait, spinning. Wait for it to stop spinning. Okay. <laughs> We're a little too okay. excited. Yeah. A little too excited. Exactly. 
a little too excited. What? How would we make a like a lipstick one? Just place like just like a waxy lipstick, like a lipstick. No, the lipstick is too waxy. It would be. Yeah, they I don't, don't know. They, yeah, it wouldn't work. Yeah. We Believe have, me, we've, we've tried. Tested, <laughs> we've stress tested it. We've all. thought about yeah, it. Yeah. Okay. All right. Should we do this? All right. Yes. All right. You place first. Look at little hands. Yes. Okay. Great. Boom. All right. Here we let go. Me get ready. Uh oh, it's hot in there. Ready? Yep. Yes. Turn it on. Oh. Cotton candy pickle Rick. Right. I don't know. You know what I'm saying. I'm just... I don't really know a lot about Rick and Morty. Yeah. Oh, it's already happening. Yes. Okay, let's go. Okay, here we go. In oh yeah, it's coming. already a little green. These. Are, this is this is happening, this is happening. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh, okay, yeah. ready? I feel like I'm like spinning yarn or something. Whoa, why is it being so crazy? Why is it being so crazy? It is being crazy. Yeah. All right. Okay, it's okay. Get, get more in the trenches there. Get more in the trenches. Right. Maybe I started too early. Yeah, you gotta get stay up, build the base. Man, it is fuzzing in here. You can't you, see. You can't see it on the camera. No, you Maybe can't. Maybe you can see it on the other camera, but yes. it's just like there's little floaties in the air. And for anyone asking, it is. It's sort of like Krusty is here with us right now. <laughs> just there's furs floating everywhere. Yeah. Um, and for anyone that's asking what pho is, I don't know exactly all of the ingredients or the best way to describe it, it's but like it is Vietnamese awesome. It's like a Vietnamese noodle soup. Yes, it is a warm soup, a hot soup. It's excellent. Um, it's great for like the the current fall weather. As it gets colder, it's an excellent one. I don't know exactly if, if it's in, it's a rice noodle, I believe. Oh, oh, oh. Um, and oh my they, god, they oh my have god, sprouts I got stuck. in it. Um, sometimes they put some like sort of, uh, what is, it? is it parsley leaves? And Parsley? No, I think it? it's uh, coriander maybe? Yeah. Jalapeno, Jalapenos, bean yeah. sprouts. It's very solid, yeah. Meat noodles and with they, a bunch of veggies. They do, yeah, sometimes they do it with like a, uh, like a chicken broth base and chicken. Dude, are we smelling anything? I can't smell anything with this one. Uh, I, I feel Mine's like just about to fall apart. Yeah, the pickle is not that fragrant. So that, I don't know. I'm oh, not the best get, expert on pho. We didn't smell the candy. Yes. We forgot but to smell I the eat candy. It all, yeah. Sorry, guys. We forgot to smell the candy. Right. Cool. Is it done? I think that that's enough for us to take some snacks. I'm trying to figure out if it's like done, done. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh, I just got a weird. Yeah, pizza. I'm smelling something odd. I, I smell pizza. Smell, I smell DiGiorno's cheese pizza. Oh, That's very specific. That. Okay. Dude, I don't... Maybe I smell something, but I don't know be, what it is. It could is. be leftover candy. It might be another. leftover. <laughs> <laughs> from it, I, that's what I think it is. What do you think, Ty? Looks okay? Okay, I'm, getting a, really? lip, no, I'm getting a pickle twinge. Oh, I smell, I smell pickle. I smell pickle. Okay, are it's, we done? We're done. Okay, we're, you know, done. we're done. It smells a little bit like the pickles that you get in your McDonald's burger. Oh, right? yeah. Yeah, the, the, the thin sliced pickles. Yeah. Not like pickled juice, but like the pickle, the actual leathery pickled cucumber. Don't mind me. Yeah. <laughs> Just coating myself. You want to take a whiff? No, I'm, I, I, can, for that? I can sniff my own hand. <laughs> um, okay, I do, I am getting very vague, very vague McDonald's burger pickle vibes. Yes. But it also kind of smells just like some dill. Okay. Not dill pickle, but like, you know, like just. It smells like when you pop the lid of a pickle jar juice for the first second. Okay. Mm, maybe the that's top layer yes. of the jar. Yeah, there there are some sweet pickles. Yeah, that's true. Okay, right, I'm ready? I'm pretty excited for this one. Okay, You're going I'm finger. Gonna, okay, I don't okay. know why I'm doing. All right, this. let me do this this why way. Why am I doing this? I'm like, do can I, I just chomp in? You want to? No. You want to pull? Don't chomp. No chomp. It ruins it for everyone. Yes. Okay, I'm good. Perfect. <laughs> <laughs> I say as I am covered in cotton candy. Okay, here we go. Cheers. Cheers. Let's do this. Okay, <laughs> really bad initial taste. Yeah. But then it kind of goes away. No, I'm enjoying my, this, this late stage. It's sort of crystallized in my mouth. It's become harder. Really bad at first. When I said dill, I mean like literally the, the herb dill. Yeah, like, like herb dill. Yeah, right? Herb right? dill. Very herby to begin. Yeah. Very herby. But at the end, it's sort of like a it's got a really Forgive me for saying it's like almost like a melon taste. It's got a really bitter top layer, like first bite. Like it like has like this uh, this like herbaceous. <laughs> and then something like almost a like cucumbery below. Oh, that would make sense. Yeah, that duh, would make sense. It's pickles. Yeah. Okay. They might have taken dill pickle a little too literally. Oh, here you go, Maddie. You want to try? It's really 
it's really it's what? really not that bad. Maddie, what? what do you think? It tastes like a candy pickle. It's, it tastes like when you first bite into a pickle, but imagine it covered in sugar. It's just like ah. yeah. Okay. Yeah. Candy pickle at like a fair festival. <laughs> it, it feels a little bit like a county fair thing. Yeah. Like, like sort of like a fried pickle. Do you know what I'm saying? I. I'm literally getting nothing. Oh no! You know that top layer is bad. Literally the herb oh. dill. I'm literally <laughs> oh, not tasting a lot of actual pickle. It's literally the herb. The first bite's awful. Yeah, it's, no, it's right. It's like a smack of herb or a chive almost, like something that would oh. be, be on top of a baked potato. Oh, okay. And then it's like something. Yeah, I mean, yeah, pickle, cucumber, melon, that kind of yeah. taste below. Fine. Once we get there. So that's why I was thinking maybe they're like dill pickle means dill, right, guys? Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, cucumber. Yeah, no, yeah. It, yeah. No, no, it, it is really bad. Really bad for her first bite. <laughs> it's bad. Yeah. Um, and and then, then we ate it more, and it was still still bad. Yeah. <laughs> Whatever <laughs> flavor they're trying to have is not welcome. But <laughs> the sweet sugar at the end is sugar. So wins all around at the end. <laughs> yeah, people are just can think that I just have no taste buds. JJ Mart says, Soph ate too many hot foods growing up and burnt her taste buds. Maybe. You know, that is a little bit true. Yeah, that my me. grandmother uh, hazed me yeah. with spicy foods. Yeah. So now I put hot sauce on almost everything in order Th to taste it. That is true. So probably no one should ever taste what I say about anything ever. Yeah. And here I am just giving opinions on the internet. <laughs> Your olfactory sensors, though. Your smelling sensors. That's, that's, the, right, that's the right word, right? Oh, that's yeah. Like olfactory. olfactory. Those are solid, though. You are good at smelling candles and weird things and then applying uh, verbiage to describe them. But I do agree, in terms of your taste, it's sriracha. Yeah. <laughs> you just put sriracha on everything, you know? Also, as we found out what? via the device we used in our video that we're editing, we were editing today. Oh, yeah. I have very hairy inner ears. Oh, yeah. So, you know, I really just got <laughs> that's a, a another, lot of receptors. That's another conversation altogether, <laughs> yeah. Um, it's better, whatever <laughs> Sophia's ear situation is, is vastly superior to my ear situation. Which, Which will never see the light less of day. Less hairy, yeah. but more clogged. More traumatizing, <laughs> yeah. Whatever has going on in my ears are things that you're never going to want to see. Like, the <laughs> like even though, if you're like, oh, I'm a big fan of Dr. Pimple Popper, doesn't matter. Doesn't <laughs> matter, yeah. All right, um, you're keeping a little bit, right? We're keeping the Frankenbite dream alive, yeah. Great. All right, so this one's still on. We can't really do anything about the leftovers, right, Carly? We should just forge ahead. I, yeah. Just for the head. Yeah, that's it's fine. Hot. Yeah. Semi mixed <laughs> flavors in here. It's okay. It's going to happen. Yeah, you can yeah, there see are some they're all hairs. rising. Yeah. I could, I could just. <laughs> oh, easy, e easy, easy. I know, I really could burn myself. Yeah. That would not be a great way to burn yourself. You go to the. Um, <laughs> oh. Emergency that one's stronger, actually. The pickle's more subtle. Now that I'm going back to that one, the pickle's more subtle. This one had a really aggressive cheese stank. <laughs> Cheese stank. Yeah, it really hit hard. Yes. Um, great. How's the chat doing? Broom Fia. Broom Fia. <laughs> and I guess this that does add to the lore of Broom Fia. <laughs> Hairy ears, hair egg <laughs> complexion. <laughs> Can uh, you imagine me when I get to be really old? I'm just going to be like straight up just a, a actual broom. You know yeah, what I mean? Just I like here, here, here. I'm, I'm aware of this reality that you're painting. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Um, okay, great. Cool. So. This guy, should we do it again? Someone said you're a wizard, Soph. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, Gandalf vibes. Okay, so um, we're saving yeah. lobster for last. Sorry, guys, we're just, we are doing lobster. It's just a reality. Well. Um, Chicken's out. It's a medium decision. Chick chicken's out <laughs> and ketchup is out. I know people decision. are saying like in the chat, like, oh, you could craft a sandwich if you did like the pickle and the chicken and then the ketchup. But that's not what the poll said. The poll said no. So we're I guess, blindly is it these two? following our Kale was never on there. So I'll put, was Kale ever on there? No. Ka no. Kale's out. Come on, Kale. Oh. <laughs> They never got to vote on it. They okay. never got to vote on Carly, it. Carly, <laughs> we're putting Kale in for this round. I'll vote for it. It might I'll actually have now a unique advantage. Carly I'll has put out there into the universe to. her interest in Kale. Um, let's put ketchup on there, too. I've. I oh, ketchup is back in? Time. Yeah, ketchup is back on the menu, boys. Ketchup's yeah. back on the menu, boys. I saw some ah. interest for it because if it's mixing with the mac and cheese, they think that that might mix the best. Oh, kale? No, ke ketchup. ketchup. Ketchup and mac, ketchup and, mac and cheese. Okay, wait. Is that a thing? Yes. 
What? <laughs> 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 Wait, From serious. the back, <laughs> Maddie wants to clarify. You like you like ketchup in I your like mac. I like ketchup on grilled cheese and ketchup with mac and cheese. Well, ketchup with grilled cheese is excellent. Oh, really quick, here's the poll. Poll's up, the guys. <laughs> Poll's in. It's up. Poll's up. All right, you Poll's guys can there. vote. Okay, so ketchup yeah. with grilled cheese makes sense. <laughs> Because tomatoes are good with grilled cheese. So once you have the, 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 the tomato threshold broken, it all makes sense, okay? But ketchup with mac and cheese, I've never had, you're just playing off the cheese what? and the- <laughs> Ketchup with mac and cheese <laughs> together. I've never done that. Say it ain't so. No, but have you ever had, get, ever put ketchup there? I like ketchup we with my literally, eggs. We literally just established that I put hot sauce on everything. Well, you <laughs> put ketchup so. on things sometimes. <laughs> That's true. Ketchup is a sauce. I have you're saucy certainly- lady. Saucy. <laughs> saucy lady. Yeah. Um, um, but anyway, my feet chat. are sounding sweaty in my Birkenstocks. Oh. <laughs> I have these like fancy. This purple, thank you. <laughs> Voting for fun just for Tyler. Appreciate it. Go for I the have fun. these like uh, fancy, these like m slightly more stylish Birkenstocks that my mom got me for my birthday. Oh, yeah. And they're like made of like a different type of like black leather, I want to say. Right. And they do sound a little squishy sometimes. Okay. So I'm just letting everyone know that that's what that sound is. I will say, I mean, I, I, it's been a couple days now, um, but Colonial Williamsburg did a serious toll on my hips and my legs. I am sore still. Well, that's what I was saying, yeah. is that the cobblestones will get you. Yeah. And all the chairs are wood. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. What's going on? Oh, yeah. I tried to get that session in with the spa. I got rejected. They that's had too true. They were booked. At all the time, yeah. <laughs> Tyler tried to get into the spa yeah. at the Williamsburg Inn, yeah. but could not. <laughs> well, it was enjoyable. I mean, the, the last time we also, we also went to Virginia um, for another video, which was a, a couple weeks ago, where we were working, we are at a, a place in Charlottesville, yeah. and that was taxing on my legs too. Every time we're there, I'm exhausted. I need it, I'm just, you know, and now I'm eating cotton candy. This is what's happening in my life right now. You need to pull yourself together, okay? I need to pull, my, you need to pull yourself together. <laughs> you need to pull yourself together. Thought is running away with it. Okay, should I turn this guy off? Okay, Deidre says, I keep wanting you to see this. Pumpkin puree can help cats with diarrhea and digestion issues. I totally understand the impulse, Deidre, but Krusty's problem is that he's like 120 years old. Yes. And that's that's the, tr the truth. Oh, no. Have. Because he go he's been, he goes to the vet all the time. He's been to many vets, many vets, and they sort of all say the same thing where he's like, they're like, He's old. Yeah. <laughs> he gets the same, like, preface every single time. They're like, okay, we're going to go back, and we're going to see what's up with your cat. And, like, this is for, like, years now. There was, like, in 2018, he took him in for an emergency clinic. They, the guy left. I don't know why. The, 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 the technician, he looked exactly like Tom Cruise. But he goes back. He's oh, yeah. there. Um, he's a very handsome man. You should, yeah, you should yeah. do YouTube. Yeah. And to dethrone Dr. Mike. Yeah. Right? Yeah, well, this would be a vet, though. It's not really the same thing. Um, but he went off, and he was like, your cat's old. It's not going to be great. Comes back. He's like, his blood's incredible. Right. He has gas. Yeah. So it's always been, like, that's kind of it. This time's a little more serious, but he is. Because he's older now. Yeah. He's but older. If it makes everyone feel better, he's eaten, apparently, like a fiend there. They're like, dude, this cat, like, likes eating. So yeah, last pumped. night he was not doing well, and then today they're like, he's got a big personality. He wants to eat everything. And he likes that his chin is being scratched. I made yeah. that very clear to them that he likes scratching <laughs> his chin. So they're scratching his chin. We're good. You know, I think we're, yeah. So, okay. Great. Ready? Yes. Pho is the winner. I'm going to end the poll. I've, I've accidentally let it go for very long. But pho is the clear winner at 44%. Okay. So. And then yes, yes, we will try at some point ketchup and canned, ketchup and mac and cheese. Because I am kind of interested in that now. I am interested, but I think pho is interesting because... Here's the interesting thing. What is interesting? Pho. Here's the interesting thing. What about is interesting? Pho, yes. Is that pho itself contains many flavors. So it's less like pickles, where it's like there's a pickle is a individual ingredient. A single one. You know what I mean? It's like a thing. Yes. Mac and cheese is sort of there are different kinds of mac and cheese and things can go into mac and cheese. Yeah. But it's still sort of the same where it's, it's like a plain it's noodle a thing, cheese, yeah. Right? But pho is like a, a dish with many ingredients. Right. So I'm interested to see how that plays out. There's a lot of prefaces you have to say here. What kind of pho? What kind of broth? Well, how much of the fish oil are we going with? What kind of toppings right, are we putting Right, because pho is quite customizable. Yes. They give you a lot of the toppings and you put them in yourself. These are questions we're going to ask. Okay, let's do this fast before mm -hmm. we lose our heat. Also preheat that one. Ah! Oh. Feeling Thank hot, hot, hot. Okay, here we go. Show show the candy, Ty. Here's the pho. Candy. Oh, it's, interestingly, in it's kind of like yellow and light green. Right. Maybe that's like a noodle and a jalapeno. Yeah. Maybe like, or... Or, or like a chicken broth. 
Sure. Yeah. Ooh. Dude, I'm literally so far ahead already. All right, go for it. Okay. Okay. I like, I like the little hands on our guys. Yeah, dropped. All right. All right, ready? Pop, drop, and lock it. Hit Let it. me in. Let me in. Unless you want to do it. Do you want to do it? No, you do it. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Go oh! for it. Okay. Oh, here we go. Yeah. Okay. Uh, I, yeah. I'm interested. Okay. <laughs> yeah. The color already is like very nondescript and pale. Right. Could be noodle. Could be noodle. Could be. I saw people in the chat trying to explain what pho is to people who don't know. Yeah, I tried too. And I yeah, didn't do a very good job. Best <laughs> explanation as someone who is not a pho expert is it's a like Vietnamese noodle soup that has a lot of like customizable ingredients that you can get like different types of protein in it, mm. different types of veggies. Noodle soup. Mmm. Soup. Oh, no, it's good soup. <laughs> no, I was doing the Joey one oh. where he goes, mmm, noodle soup. <laughs> that's, go, that's it's dated. just soup. Yeah, no, it's a noodle soup. Um, and, uh, yeah, I mean, I, I think the signature thing for pho for me is that it's got like a very distinct rice noodle to me. Like I really right. like the noodles in pho. Like they're kind of like more pale. Um, they're like this, it's they have like a nice a texture. Yeah. I really like them. They're really good, yeah. In, But I'm kind of a noodle guy. In college- I some, like all noodles. Some of my friends would always go to pho as like a hangover food. Ah. So I spent many a weekend like morning at pho. Right. Like before noon pho. See, I'm more of like a, if you're hungover, you gotta go pure grease kind of person. I think grease is the, tr the, the true cure, you know? I think that they were going for like salt and carbs. Yeah, that, well, the carbs and the salt and the, I mean, the broth makes sense, but you don't wanna like extra dehydrate yourself. Dude, listen. Was there any logic? We were college kids. Yeah. We knew what we were talking <laughs> you were about. You were searching for any solution here, right? All right, I made a really weird thing. <laughs> it doesn't look good, but I bet you we could still eat it. We could definitely still eat it. <laughs> no, no, hold on, time out. We're going to eat it. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> but there was never a question of not that's eating. That's not it. a debate. It was here. just that I didn't. It doesn't look good. Yeah. Here, I'll I'll take the piece that's at the bottom. I right, watch your step here. You take that, Ty. Hello. Oh. What happened? Yeah, it was just it was starting to sink down. It's very uh, Sheila's web, right? Yeah. Okay. This guy <laughs> does not want to stay on. Yeah. I have a little bit down here. Yeah. Okay, ready? Yes. Okay, this is custom cotton candy, round three, pho edition, right? Here you go, cheers. The color is really nondescript. Yeah, okay. I like that. That is super good, actually. What is going on? You know what it tastes like? Tell me. Fennel. <laughs> what is fennel? It's like that thing. Doesn't it taste like licorice? Fennel? Oh. Yes. Oh yeah, it, it does tastes have like licorice. A vague licorice vibe. Yeah. You know what this tastes like? Oh wait, I got it. Ready? You know those spring rolls that have sort of like the clear uh, casing at Vietnamese restaurants? Yes. Right, and they have sort of like that. Is there not, a different it, name for it besides spring roll? Summer no, roll? No, I know what you're talking the about. spring rolls, right? Yes. And they and they have like you can see through them. So like you can see when they have like shrimp or meat in them, right? And they tend to have like that that vegetable that's in them. We, we were we were talking about it. Is it coriander? Is it parsley? Is it cilantro? It's one of those ones, remember? And it tastes like that vegetable. And oh oh oh, it tastes it's like the lettuce. The lettuce. Cilantro and mint. Yeah, that's the what mint. It is. It's the yeah. mint. Yeah, right. Mm -hmm. That's that's unfun. Yeah, it's cilantro. Yes. So that means that to some people out there, this tastes like soap. Yes. What? Cilantro some people. Like soap. Some people have like. I think an actual, like genetic thing that makes cilantro taste like soap to them. Really? Yeah. Interesting. That, though I did definitely the worst job with the cotton candy cone so far. <laughs> Although I blame that on the- Yes, I think so. Second round yeah. in this machine thing. <laughs> that is a very good taste. That is awesome. I taste no, no meat. No meat, no like pickled vegetable. No. No bean sprout. No. Mostly herby. But yeah. it's not a dill. No. It's like, yeah, cilantro, mint. I think it must be that the combination of cilantro and mint yes. together tastes like fennel. You remember that Vietnamese restaurant we used to go to in Los Angeles in Burbank, yes. right? Mama Hong's, yep. right? And they would have those spring rolls, right? And they would have the, the meat on the top. Like it'd be a shrimp or it'd be like a pork or it'd be like a steak. And when you bite it, obviously sometimes you pull and then you would like accidentally pull out 
some of the meat. So then your last bite would just be like lettuce and spring roll and some of this mint. And that last bite mm. would taste like that. Mm. Two, two updates. Yes. A lot of people in the chat are letting us know Nani Mouse 07 says coriander equals cilantro. Oh. So I think it's the same thing. Um, a, a lot of people in the chat have the cilantro tastes like soap thing. Yeah. A lot of people. Krista Simpson says cilantro is nasty. Sam West says, oh, I have that. Mm-hmm. Hope Adler says, it's a gene. Yeah, you have I that, have Maddie? That. You don't like cilantro. Edwardian. So I like taco. Bookboard. Can't get cilantro. Says, I have that. Yeah. Well, cilantro has like an extremely fresh flavor. And I mean, like, and I mean that with, can be a Mr. Clean fresh level, right? Where it does yeah. have like almost like a, a pine salt to it. Not like literally, but oh. kind of like so clean it almost tastes like a cleaning agent. Yes. Three things. Alexia, Mod Alexia also says cilantro tastes like soap to her. Um, Good and Green says the flavor you're talking about is star anise. Oh, wow. That sounds so extremely So that sounds like a specific. culinary term. Yes. It sounded right. Yeah. <laughs> Moon emoji says, mmm. Good soup. Okay. <laughs> Great. Yeah, people are now just talking about cilantro. Okay. I don't have the cilantro tastes like soap thing, but sometimes cilantro gets to be too much for me. So I think for me, it's not a genetic thing. It's just like a preference thing where like I can like it and then all of a sudden it there's a threshold. I'm kind of medium on cilantro. Yeah, but I, that was good. Yeah, that was an excellent bite. There's not that much left, so we need to save it for a Franken bite. Yes. So. Sorry, Maddie will not give us well, a flavor, but like we had very, very yeah. clear vision on that one. And you don't even like cilantro, so no. we're doing you a favor. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> okay. Um, so I think that we're at the point that all paths lead to, at least for this stream, right? We're at the lobster, oh. which is... Uh, <laughs> no. <laughs> okay, I'm uh, just going to collect the pickle. This isn't good news. Um, collect the pickle. And I think that following pickle up with lobster is also... Yeah, it, that first flavor. Pickle's no good. Once you have the pho, how could you ever subject yourself? Yeah, it, it grows. <laughs> first it's sour, then it's sweet. Right? Oh, yeah, yeah. First it's bitter herb, and then it's like a passable cucumber. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Sorry, guys, there's no pull. All roads lead to lobster, baby. Yeah. We got to do it, right? Uh, right? When this thing infects your apartment with such a noxious smell for months. You have to you, do it again. You have to try it. <laughs> you have to go, what was that? I need to understand the mind of this this demonic candy. We need to now make it cotton candy and try it. Yeah. Right? It's very, yeah. This is going to fall over and make a huge noise. Never it's mind. It's like when, when everyone in every Halloween movie needs to understand the mind of Michael Myers. And they all get obsessed with it and all of his psychiatrists or whatever, yeah, all his support at the different places. They try to understand Michael Myers. They want him to talk. We need to understand this lobster candy, right? So yes, that's a deep cut Halloween reference for you. Okay. <laughs> SK with OV says, "Do a lobster poll where, where all the options are lobster." <laughs> sure, I'll do it. Yeah, let's do it. Okay, <laughs> I'll do it. Why don't we try to? Why don't we make watch the world meltdown? We'll go. Okay, Maine lobster versus Boston lobster versus Red lobster versus I don't know. You know, something like that. I'm saying lobster. Larry the lobster. The 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 lobster roll. Okay, lobster, lobsty, Mick lobster face, lobster. And then we said Larry the lobster. Larry the lobster. Okay, this is the official test. Great. Yeah. <laughs> That's the poll. Yeah. That's the poll, everyone. Yeah. <laughs> Dude, now that I know this poll thing exists, we should use this more. Yeah. <laughs> we can harness so much power here. What are you doing? Are I'm you seasoning, seasoning your arm? You're seasoning my arm. This is my bit, guys. Go. This is an extremely long-lasting bit. Uh, that first thing that Sophia did was her basting my arm. No, actually, I, I have basted your arm before. Yeah. I was actually doing more of the Looney Tunes thing. You know, like when uh, like different animals in Looney Tunes catch each other? Yes. They like roll up their fur yeah. to kind of like expose the leg underneath. Yeah. That's what I do. I go. <laughs> but there's a lot of examples like where like it'll be like an animal like standing there talking to some another one, and like he's not paying attention, and like then like the wolf comes up to go eat them while they're not paying attention, and they'll be like basting it and stuff like that, and they get ready to bite, and then often it'll be like. It'll be something like the Road Runner, and he does that like looky loo where he switches it out and he bites like a anvil, you know. <laughs> By the way, uh, real quick, say, bring out the dancing lobsters. There is sure. a uh, there's a Gilmore Girls bit where okay. Lorelai talks. The chat? Yeah, you can. Talks <laughs> I'm gonna ex- close the poll. I mean, t- close tolls, the poll. Tol- talks extensively about where all the anvils have gone in the world because she says like, okay, Road Runner slash Coyote, they're always like dropping anvils on each other. Saf actually used an anvil. Oh, I did. At Colonial Williamsburg. Oh. You actually 
actually use Wait, an anvil. Wait, how did I miss this? Yeah, right. Is that what I bent it against? That's an anvil. Sop actually got to do the full blacksmith thing with like heated metal and like wrapping it around and like the funny smacking thing is, it and stuff. Depending on yeah. how much it gets in there, we can we we'll see how much because some of it something of it will be in the video. But like the blacksmith at Colonial Williamsburg like would not let me off the hook. Like I was like, can I come and smack something? And he's like, no, you're gonna make this hook from start to finish, and you are not gonna stop. So I like had to keep putting it because I'm not very good at it. Oh, this is a barn burner. I had to keep putting it back into the, yeah. the heat and then like doing the bellows to like heat the, th it was hard. Yeah. Anyway. So I did it for like a solid like 30 minutes. Okay. Um, so no, Larry the Lobster wins no, at 30. No, 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 it's, oh, oh my God, it was close. Larry the Lobster wins at 31%. Oh, that's actually just like a clean stratification. Yeah. It's like 30, 30, 30, right? Yeah. All right, ready? Cool. Great. Okay. Let's turn that guy off. Right, turn it off for a second. Oh yeah. All right, show us the lobster candy. Yes. LD says blacksmithing is so hard. Dude, yes. Yes. We actually, obviously that video is not going to be just about blacksmithing, but we are, you know, in, interested in more like sort of jewelry making things. Oh, you already took them out. Yeah. Oh, it's really orange. For some reason I thought it'd be redder. This isn't good, guys. Um, I think that this is where we have to conclude the stream. We have to do this, but this is not going to be good. Oh, 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 oh. This is going to be... I thought you were... I, I, I've already accepted my fate. Yeah. I thought there was a new development. This is going to be very, <laughs> very quiet. Oh my god. I can actually smell them as I open the bag. Yes. It okay, people are asking, does it smell fishy? No, not at all. It smells. What does it smell like? It smells like a buttery oh, lobster shell, or like a lobster roll. It, it's got more of like a lo cooked <laughs> lobster. Vibe. Yeah, yeah. It doesn't smell like a fish market, but it no. does have like a little bit of a fishy smell. No, there's some fish in there. Like like shellfish. Like it does smell like lobster. Buttery lobster. Like cooked. Yeah, cooked buttery lobster. Yes. Okay. Oh my god. See you on the other side, guys. <laughs> oh my god. Someone was saying I shouldn't put the stick so far into the bowl. I'm just trying to I'm just trying to get the cotton candy out any way possible. Oh here we go. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. As Maddie okay, puts here her we go. on. <laughs> oh god. I actually think that somehow my position is one of the least <laughs> Carly, can you smell it? <laughs> my my position right behind the machine is one of the least scent blasted. <laughs> So I feel like you guys all get it worse before I turn it off. I definitely Carly got it really fast. <laughs> so many memories. Oh my god. Oh, it's such a weird smell because it actually there's some layer of it that like smells good. Like it kind of. I started like. Yeah, it smells kind of cool. <laughs> Maddie I likes it. I don't know what it. it it's got like this almost. Is like it smells butter? Like, Is it like the butter you put on the lobster? Yeah. It's got a very. It's like full buttery flavor. popcorn, but it's yeah. not. It almost has like a. It's. It's almost like a jerky too. It almost has like you know like a very like when they like have like a. <laughs> Of I like how I did firing. a really bad job on the pho one, which was the best, and I'm doing. Look at look at how large <laughs> this cone <laughs> is about to be. Maybe that person was right. I shouldn't be sticking it so far in. Yeah. What is in this thing? I like how they don't even. Dude, have I'm literally getting the most out of this one. Oh yeah, there's no ingredients on there. I was yeah. wondering if it was actual meat or not. <laughs> yeah. I think that like in like sort of like um. I don't know, like Moby Dick world, that like lobster was like the, it, it was considered very, very bad food. Because it's like a, sort of a huge, historically, lobster, they would grind the lobster meat up with the shells. So when you would eat lobster, you would have to like pick through to Wait, take at, out the shells. Something just flew out at me. Okay, there we go. Yes. Lobster roll. Lobster. It's a lobster roll. This is the official lobster roll. We're trademarking that. This is the name. There's no other lobster rolls that exist. Okay, from afar, like the room right now does smell kind of like a vaguely tinged butter, but when you get up close, what I smell that? like a fishy smell. What, it's got something. Like, what is that smell? Let me, it's let upsetting. Me. <laughs> it smells like almost like you know what it smells a little bit like when you fry something like a, like an egg roll and you immediate it's immediately out, so it's like freshly fried. The outside of it kind of has like okay. The, 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 right, like the boiling oil sort of has like a little two bit of things. fishy smell. One, it smells a little bit like fish sauce. Oh and yeah. And two, it smells a little bit like seaweed, like like nori. Get really close in. Why do I think but it smells good? Plus butter though. <laughs> okay. It's, it's it's because it's not green. It's hard to like associate those smells together. You know what I mean? I think it smells good. It smells good. Yeah. Okay. I actually really like the smell. <laughs> okay. <laughs> but, okay, but <laughs> who, I, who has the concussion but, now? Carly goes, when when I, I thought it, I liked you. When I did it a month ago, all I could hear was how awful it, it was. It, it, it's so the, when I do it. Remember when that's you and true. I walked into the apartment after 
afterwards in the room. It did not smell good afterwards. No, it didn't. No, yeah. It, like, it permeated the walls. <laughs> it was, it, I, it's this plus wall paint yeah. is not a good mix. I agree with Carly. When she did it, you guys were all coming <laughs> no. down hard on her. And now, <laughs> That's true. now it's all good. No. I was so attacked. But I think we were more <laughs> confused as to what had happened. Because we left a perfectly <laughs> fine smelling room just to come back into hellscape. That's true. <laughs> I was left alone. Yes. <laughs> yeah. That should never happen. Here, here you go. Okay, should we do this? Dude, that's a big chunk. I'm doing this. Okay. Fish offs and seaweed. Ooh, okay, that's a that's a deep smell right there. Right, Kelpie. All right, cheers. Were okay. you trying to feed me the larger yeah. chunk? Oh, it's disgusting. <laughs> okay. That is so gross. It's hard to salvage that one. It's hard to find a good thing in there. Because at the beginning, it kind of tastes like garbage. <laughs> like literal garbage. Like something rotten. At the very end, though, it ends on just a seaweed note. Which is better. I'm actually trying to swallow it still. <laughs> I'm like trying to like get to the finish point. Whoa. Whoa, that's disgusting. See, this is the only one I actually tried, so... <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> That's why Carly's never trying anything she ever makes for the stream ever again. Maddie, you can try it. Yeah. No. Maddie does not like it. No. <laughs> oh. There's something like bad. It's like in the beginning, it's like bad. <laughs> and then it kind of tastes like a weirdly sweet. Like, does. Like, I'm sure some, somewhere seaweed candy exists, and it does taste a little bit like that at the end. But you have to get through the initial taste to get there, and the initial taste is garbage. I like a it, lot of seaweed stuff. Like the aftertaste. Oh, the end okay. Is not that bad. Aftertaste is okay. I like a lot of seaweed products, things. I'm okay with seaweed usually. I'm not like a seaweed super stan. Um, I, mean, I get my ramen without the seaweed, but I do. I don't think the, the seaweed is what's throwing it off. I don't even know what that is that I'm tasting right there. <laughs> Anya said, Carly says, in my defense, I was left unsupervised. <laughs> that is true. Sometimes people, I heard, I saw somewhere, I saw justice for Carly. <laughs> um, okay. Yeah. Where's all the bottles of water in the corner? I know. This is the, um, our the one time we don't have giant empty. jars of water yes. in the corner. Uh, okay. I have some yeah. mac and cheese cotton candy flavored coffee <laughs> what? in case anyone's interested. What nightmare am I within right now? I feel like I'm trapped in a glass case of emotion. Yeah. Okay. I have. So I'm just people... so mad that this stuff is on my fingers right now. Because oh. <laughs> well. I'm like, do I lick this off and just suffer through that? Or, yeah. yeah. I think we should. I'm just going to wait it out. Um, okay. <laughs> okay, so we promised them a Franken bite. Yeah, you want to eat yeah. around that one, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, we did. We promised them a Franken bite. Mm, yeah, we did. <sighs> yeah, we said that. <laughs> That's something we said. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> we learned a lot here today, everybody. What a fun time. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Okay. Yeah, people want, want the Franken candy. Let's... Yeah. Oh no! <laughs> Surge protector! Why does this keep happening? Someone find the kettle! Plug it in! Fast! Fast! <laughs> <laughs> okay, uh, let's get to the finish line here. Great. Let's do it. Franken bite on its way. Yeah. Okay, I can. If Alexia I can... says, suddenly the Franken has turned on you. <laughs> yeah, it's not the first time, I will say. You'll see in this new Franken video that we're editing, it's a little. You think the Franken has turned on us in that one? Well, no. No, <laughs> it's just it's just it, it, it was um it started off bad but then it turned out good. It's it's a big time ordeal. Which is what I'm hoping for here. Okay, what is this? I have pho in here. Yeah, you have pho. Am I supposed to serve myself or are you serving me? W with what hands? <laughs> <laughs> what, what, what hands do I have? My hands look like troll dolls right now. Okay. <laughs> oh my god, why can I not get this? Is I have too much pickle. Okay, I have pho. I have pickle. I have mac and cheese. Dude, why did you leave me only giant chunks? And I have lobster. Lobster. I'm gonna do the thing. I throw the lobster over my shoulder before I shake it. You're like General. Uh, you're like uh, Uncle Iroh. Just like yeah. <laughs> all right, ready? Yeah. All right, ready? All right. Can you see it? It's hard to see. They're all sort of subtle colors, but you can kind of see. There's a, like a little ombre. Uh, 
It's just horrifying. Pastel okay. vibes. Bottoms up. Let's do it. It's so bad. <laughs> it's so bad. The problem is. I'm getting a lot of dill. Oh no, there's the lobster. I'm getting a lot of dill. <laughs> the initial taste is awful, but then it all boils down to fennel or star anise. It all boils down to that, because I think the dill meets the, the, the cilantro and the mint star anise flavor to just be like a, an herb garden. And the lobster sort of forgotten by the end. I saw someone say in the chat, Tyler didn't get all of them. I promise you I got a lot of all of them, <laughs> including that, that lobster. I will say the only saving grace was some of the pho came through. <laughs> I was trying to evaluate it. I'm trying to give it a fair shake here. There is a strategy that you can pull that is the cinnamon uh, the, the cinnamon challenge strategy. Where you take where, a bite, you put it in the... No, that's not how you do it. That is how you do it okay. with the cinnamon challenge. In the cinnamon challenge, yeah. the way you do it is you take your cinnamon and you gather some saliva and you move the cinnamon to your cheek. Yes. Until you have enough saliva to make it wet enough to swallow. And you can eat it in very small bits because you can't eat it straight. So if you get in there, and you don't want to inhale it because it's bad for your lungs. But with this... It why would you? No, but that would make it last longer. Yeah, but it, then it blends together more. Okay. Yeah, okay, it okay. loses. It becomes more like a sugar, okay. sugar blast. Okay. Without a doubt, the worst one is the lobster, <laughs> by a lot. To me, the second worst is the pickle, because it starts off with a really, a really unpleasant taste, really bad taste. Yeah. Though it bl it blends down. How, not that's not the right word. <laughs> it, it 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 mellows out. It mellows out. Yes, yeah. Right, it melons right. it out. Mellows. Then I think that my next favorite is the, the mac and cheese one, which you might even agree with me at this point, even though you didn't like it. Yeah, no, yeah. I, I, mac and cheese. Yeah, the, exactly. And I think that the pho one is just straight up good. I like the pho one a lot. Yeah. Um, actually, uh, I think it's, it's quite refreshing. Uh, the questions I see there are, Tyler's just trying to not barf emoji. Tyler, are you okay? <laughs> um, I will say. Dale Mao 5 says, just joined, what I missed. Uh, you missed a lot. Uh, no, I will say that the the lobster be, between the lobster. I got hit by lop. Here's here's what happened when I took the Franken bite. I got hit Tell by us. dill pickle, oh. which was unpleasant. Yep. Then I had a moment of pho, so I let down my guard, and then as it crystallized, I got just launched by the lobster. Yeah. I got clamped, and I couldn't get away, and they just started just to just destroy my system. And then my body did the inevitable thing where it said, "Don't swallow this. <laughs> Do not eat this. This is a mistake. You know it." Because the colors are quite similar, yeah. licking your fingers afterwards is kind of like a chat roulette. You know what I mean? Chat roulette. <laughs> <laughs> you guys don't remember chat roulette? It was uh, like the Omegle. It was person. like Omegle. Yeah. yeah, exactly. It's like, what What could it be? And you never know. Could could be a lobster. Could, it could be a star anise. Yeah. Could be, could uh, be a naked guy. Naked guy. <laughs> <laughs> um, great. So how's it how's it going over there? <laughs> Tyler's crying. So you don't have to do it. I'm doing it as fast as possible. You don't have to. Oh, so I feel like now I bullied you into doing it. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, it's really gross. Oh, I'm gonna get a drink some of the coffee. I'll just I'll brave the uh, other cotton candy. Honestly, the coffee's good. So like I really you really don't need to be Woo! so condescending about it. So <laughs> condescending. Yeah. Okay. All right. Oh man. So Tyler, have we learned a lot here today? I came in with a decent amount of confidence in this. I thought it was going to be kind of like just whatever, they taste a little funky, <laughs> uh, no big deal, hard candies, we're going to go through this. And actually, I was a somewhat chipper when I was smelling the lobster because I was like, that doesn't smell so bad. I could definitely stomach this. <laughs> but I was, what I learned was the, the lesson of humility, <laughs> that I, I was catac cataclysmically wrong. And uh, like Icarus fell from the sky, so did my taste buds. So I did learn a lot today that this machine is evil. Yeah. Uh, like the Ring of Power, it should not be trifled with. Yeah. Yes. Did you learn anything too, Saf? Um, I, no, I think that, <laughs> I don't know if I learned anything. I think that I just liked this more than I thought I would. Oh, yeah. But I guess that people, that's what the chat expects from me now, because I have an agreeable palate. People find your, uh, your tasting very troublesome. Yeah. I'm trying to think if there's anyone in, in the chat. Froglings Reborn says, what are they going to do with the rest of the candy? 
And I'll probably try and pawn it off on these guys. <laughs> <laughs> lobster? Yeah. Anyone miss the stream yesterday? Yeah. Lobster? <laughs> it's really good. Yeah. <laughs> what if we did like you know like there's I saw this like one TikTok where the person like has like candies like gummy candies and stuff and they like drop them like sort of aesthetically into like mm. a container and sells them. What if we made like we unwrapped all of these guys exactly. and got containers and then dropped them in as like sort of like mystery we things. Halloween. Oh yeah. That's like that's evil. Oh, <laughs> we we'll just leave these oh guys out there, yeah, in our hallway, because like cause that would be just straight up bullying children. <laughs> I, <laughs> Here you go, have fun. New letter from the leasing office. So <laughs> <laughs> no, but I actually saw someone in the chat asking if we would do a TikTok with the other flavors. So maybe we will. Yeah. That doesn't mean we're going to go through all the candies that are in there. No, but, the candies yeah. are here. Yeah. Unfortunately, yes. Yeah. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Um, well. We did get through that pretty quickly. These yeah. machines look pretty cooked right now, I gotta be honest. They don't I think look like they. Good. I think Carly has done many a stress test on the full capacity <laughs> in one cleaning of these machines. And I think two is the top out. So Oh, Jamestown in the chat says one thing we did learn about today is poles in the chat. Yes, we did learn that. Yeah. And it's a big, big it's a big dynamic. Here's the thing is, I've seen other people do it, but for some reason it never registered in my mind that we could also do it. It, it felt a little TikTokian, whereas you started to like talk about the need of a poll, it's like, do you want this feature? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you know, like, it just kind of like appeared uh -huh. at the right time. You're like, that's weird. Um, so, that is possible. Mystic Love says both my top picks didn't get picked. I apologize, but you know. You guys are, it's, it's a mob mentality. Right. So <laughs> Literally, we're making it a poll. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Um, but cool. Uh, I think that's good. That is a good stream. This is a slightly shorter one. That's but okay. We stream every they Tuesday. They don't always have to be two hours long. They, last, one of them can be an hour 15. Last Tuesday was the ab abnormality. But if you did not get to watch our pumpkin spice stream, that is actually back up. It's yes. taking a hot second. It is a little confused it. because it says stream two weeks ago, but then it's like the most recent one. Yes. But it's there, it's on the channel page. All of our sugar crash and glory is there. So yeah. if you wanna see that, uh, you That's know, what I'm trying to avoid right no, now. We are trying to avoid that. Because yes. I feel like your impulse is to do another one, but I'm like, we need to be alive. We need to live. That is true. Um, so <laughs> anyway, uh, yes, if you liked this stream, again, we do it every Tuesday at 5 p.m. Eastern. You're gonna uh, sh smash the like button? You're gonna smash that like button, and if you want to see more streams like this, you can smash that subscribe button. Um, we have an Instagram. These One. are both of them. We have TikTok. Uh, and we also have, I think, a couple of really solid main channel videos that we're working on right now. So we yeah. have a lot of stuff going on. It's a lot I of mean, fun. I feel like we've been mentioning a bunch of stuff we've been filming. Yes. So we have a lot of stuff in the works. Yes, we do. Yeah. And uh, yeah. My and hands are just so sticky. Yeah, they're, they're, just very, like, they're very unpleasant. We just have yes. a lot of stuff in the works. Yeah, just get those hands away from me. Yeah, no, and so we have a lot of great stuff, so we can't wait for you guys to see that. Um, yeah, I mean, listen, I don't uh, want to you know, bring down the spirits here, but I saw everyone's kind of emojiing for Krusty. I mean, obviously, we're hoping that he turns out okay. Um, if he doesn't, then you know, he's had a pretty awesome life. It's been really fun for him, and we've had a lot of fun with him. So um, anyway. Well, we we'll, we'll, yeah. We'll figure out how to, yeah, we'll figure out what, what happens. I don't really know yet. But anyway, so we hope you guys. Probably no news is good news. Oh, yeah, no. It's from for you no. guys also. Yeah, exactly. Like if, we, if, 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 if you don't hear anything from us, Krusty's probably fine. Right, exactly. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Um, but he's like, you know, using the nine lives thing, he's on life like 15. Yeah. So he's really <laughs> pushing it right now. Um, but anyway, so we hope you guys like this stream. We had a really good time. Our taste buds are questionable right now. They are. They might never recover. Um, in fact, whatever thing Sophia has, this might have shocked our taste buds <laughs> it's like to be the lost SpongeBob forever. thing where like the breath kind of comes out, <laughs> and curls out. Like, exactly. Yes. You, you, <laughs> how did you get close so fast? Um, okay. <laughs> you just came right up. To I me. I sway. Okay. <laughs> I think everyone knows that I sway. Um, so I swayed into that one. Um, anyway, so I feel like this is a long sign off. We had a good time. I hope you guys had a good time, and we'll see you guys next time.